Okay, classic rate of change problem. Uh, we are asked to determine the rate of change between minutes 2 and 4 on the graph above and round your answer to the nearest tenth. So it's important to notice getting started that time, as always, is on the x-axis here. Uh, and so when we're looking for the second minute, we're going to be looking over here. Look at degrees Fahrenheit along the y-axis. We check out the points we've got at minute 2. We've got 2 degrees Fahrenheit. And at minute 4, we have 8 degrees Fahrenheit. So, next step is to pull up the rate of change formula, which page one in your science reference table tells us the change in field value over time. Well, the time is clearly going to be from minutes two to four, and that would give us two total minutes of time, whereas the change in the values would be the values in the temperature going from two degrees Fahrenheit to eight degrees Fahrenheit. So if we substitute our data into the problem, we come up with this, we simplify it, and we get 6 degrees Fahrenheit per every 2 minutes. So the last step we have to do here is to simply simplify this. And 2 divided by uh, 6 divided by 2 gives us a 3. But we're asked also to give it to the nearest tenth place. So we need to provide a 0 to hold that place. So there's our answer. 3.0 degrees Fahrenheit per minute. And that's it.